so uh, I introduce you to do while loop but there is a problem of this program so when you do this program uh, negative one will stop but it doesn't prevent you to enter invalid number for example if I stop this program and without debugging then uh, I'm going to pull a uh, negative uh, 25 and it will say negative 25 uh, no so so this is not good all right so uh, I'm going to introduce you different way to do it uh, the way we do it usually is this, okay? Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, so usually is this way, okay? So I'm going to show you this. I'm going to fix this program right now for you. So enter your age, all right? Enter negative one to stop. But here I'm going to put here is uh, 0 to 100. Okay, so I'll tell them that don't give me anything, something. All right, maybe 110 people getting older and older right now. All right, so right here, uh, when age is not equal to 1, we get into here. So usually we are going to use a if else statement here to control, called error handling. So I'm going to say, hey, guys, if uh, the age is uh, greater than greater than equal zero, all right, and the age uh, is less than uh, equal a hundred, so that means uh, this age is between this this is uh, age is between uh, zero. Uh, this is mathematic equation all right so th these are the age we all agree then put sorry i already say we want to do 110 some people are get people getting older and older all right so if that we're going to say this control x all right then else all right so else we're going to say this see out so you're not inside this okay we say um enter uh, age uh age entered uh is uh invalid age enter okay sorry invalid age uh entry then we just going can tell, tell them one more time must be uh, between 0 to 110 all right so we give them an opportunity to to learn that you guys say uh, you know you made a mistake okay you, you give them one more time uh, one more chance so here we allow them to and uh, so we usually eat so the if else statement we learned from chapter um, 4 5 uh sorry chapter five six and it's used to, it is used to combine it's used to it's used to combine it uh with a it's used to combine with a uh if else statement so that way uh we can uh control the error handling the way we call this is called error handling so let's run this right now build it and start without debugging so right now if i'm going to enter negative 25 25 and invalid h entry okay so you're going to do one more time so uh 30 so your age is 30 years old and 120 not invalid entry all right so uh 20 a all right then negative one and the program will stop all right so this is the uh one uh with a while loop uh combined with the if else to do the uh to prevent user 
enter the invalid number, and this we call error handling. I hope the program helped. I hope this video helped you. I hope you like the programming.